yield curves are determined by current interest rates and the credit risk of those borrowing money. The higher the level of credit risk, the greater the cost of borrowing. Here we have the yield curve for US Treasuries. They have minimal credit risk and hence a low yield curve. AAA rated companies have a slightly higher level of credit risk than US government treasuries. Therefore, investors expect a slightly higher return when lending money to AAA companies rather than the US government. This is reflected in a slightly higher yield curve. The gap between the yield on a bond and the government yield curve is called the credit spread. As the credit risk of companies increase, the yield curve for those companies gets higher and higher. Once a company loses investment grade status, the cost of borrowing increases significantly. Companies that don't have investment grade status are called high yield or junk bonds. Credit spreads change as economic conditions change. When the economy is deteriorating, as we saw in late 2007 and 2008, credit spreads widen. This reflects the added risk in lending to these companies. As economic conditions improve, credit spreads narrow because of an improvement in the credit quality of the companies. As credit spreads narrow, bond yields fall, which means the prices of these bonds are increasing.